you guys. It's time. It is officially, officially time. Hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. You already know what today's video is going to be. We are going to be talking all about the YouTube subscriber plaque, the one specifically that you get when you hit 100,000 subscribers, but I'm assuming that the process is the exact same when you hit the other milestones here on YouTube. So I've actually had this plaque sitting in my home for a month and I haven't opened it yet because I wanted to do it for this YouTube video. So in this video, I'm going to be talking about how you can get your subscriber plaque. So whether you are close to that 100, thousand milestone or maybe you're just curious for when you hit that in the future I had no idea before I was a youtuber I honestly just thought that you gave your address to YouTube and then they just sent you your plaque when in reality there's a process that you have to go through and I'm going to be explaining that in this video and then of course we are going to be opening up <sighs> this bad guy I'm telling you it's been staring at me for a month and I need I need to open it so I hit 100,000 subscribers on April 14th of 2020, and I did film a full vlog of that day, my reaction, as well as a video talking about how I went from zero to 100,000 subscribers. So if you guys wanna check those out, I will include both of them in the description bar down below. But when I was getting close to that 100,000 subscriber mark, I wanted to do my research and I wanted to make sure that I was prepared so that I could get my plaque as early as possible. So I went to Google and I started typing in how to receive your subscriber award or how do you get your 100,000 silver play button? And there's a couple of different terms for it, but I was just going to Google and typing in all these things. And I ended up finding a couple of really good resources that gave me some information, but not the full picture. And then I ended up figuring out that there is a page on YouTube's platform that tells you exactly how to get your subscriber plaque. So I already have the page open right here and I will include actually all these links in the description bar down below for you guys. But if you scroll down a little bit, obviously we are talking about the Silver Creator Award when you hit 100,000 subscribers, but they have a three-step process of how it works. So the first one, eligibility review. Basically what it's telling you is that YouTube needs to go through a review your channel just like they do when you become monetized to make sure that you are legit, that you are a real person, you're not spam, as well as your subscribers are not fake. So it just wants to make sure that you are a good channel and you have a good standing with YouTube as well. And then over here, it says once your eligibility is approved, you'll get a notification on the creator studio within one week of passing the creator awards milestone. And then it talks about the shipping. So what I had done, because I had done a decent amount of research, I heard of a lot of people that had to end up emailing YouTube because they never got the notification. And I even saw some people that said the notification is going to be really, really obvious. So at first I was searching all through YouTube and I was waiting to see a notification because people had said that it was so obvious. And I will show you guys what it looks like because it is obvious but several other creators have said that you need to email YouTube if you want a pretty quick turnaround so actually I'm gonna scroll up here and I want to show you guys I ended up clicking on this button right here get my award because obviously I wanted to get my award I knew that I had passed 100,000 subscribers but what I had found is that you need a redemption code and in the notification that's going to appear on your creator studio that is going to have your redemption code but I didn't have that notification yet so they actually give you an email address right here that you can email if you want to speed up the process. Now, because I knew that I was going to be filming this YouTube video, I really wanted to see how long it would take for the notification to appear within my creator studio. So I gave YouTube three weeks. Sure, I could have given them more time if I really wanted to see how long it took, but I didn't want to wait that long for my award, guys. After three weeks on May 7th, I decided to take that email address and email them and see what was going on. So I've got the full email exchange for you guys. On May 7th at 3.54 p.m., I decided to email the creator support and I basically just said, hey, a couple of weeks ago, I raised 100,000 subscribers on YouTube. I sent the link to my YouTube channel so they could check it out. I haven't received a notification on my creator studio. Please let me know what I can do to receive my award. And within less than 24 hours the very next day I ended up getting a response from Sheila so thank you so much Sheila but she basically just said looks like my channel is due for review which like they said in that three-step process the first thing they need to do is review your YouTube channel so she said that she's going to bring it to her team and get my channel looked at then again less than 24 hours later so this is only two days actually less than a full two days after I emailed them they got back to me and said congratulations and they sent me a redemption code and they also sent me a link to the website that I already shared with you guys where you can enter your redemption code 
forward. But the other thing is once I got that email, a notification did pop up within my creator studio with my redemption code as well. I am not sure if it's because of the new creator studio. I'm not sure if it's because there's so many YouTube channels that they have to review. I mean, if you think about how many YouTube channels there are and how many people end up hitting 100,000 subscribers in a month, I, I don't even know that stat to give you guys, but it was once she got back to me with my redemption code, then it appeared within my creator studio. And the process to actually getting your reward was so, so easy. We're going to do it. Oh my gosh, I cannot. I finally got my code so I can do it. I can put in my submission and get my plaque and oh, I'm so excited. Going to click claim now. Please verify your channel name below so we can accurately display it. Continue. Okay. Okay, Catherine Manning sent to my address. Confirm my order. Did it go through? It didn't give me a confirmation or anything saying that it went through. Let me see if I can check order status. Oh, okay, I clicked on check order status and it has appeared right here. So it says my creator reward will be handled in three to four days, shipped to my address in one to two weeks. <gasps> yes! You guys know they have to print out one of these custom for every creator because it has your name on it. So I thought it was going to take a little bit of time, but honestly, two days later, they ended up sending me another email saying that my subscriber award was on its way. And then they give you a button where you can track your order. So the process like YouTube has got it down and I, I could not believe like it arrived at my house so, so freaking fast. Now is the time that you guys have been waiting for, that I have been waiting for, and I feel like this shouldn't be a surprise for you guys. I just, I can't thank you enough for helping me get here. It was October that I redid my vision board, and one of the things on my vision board was a picture of the 100,000 subscriber plaque. This year, I really wanna focus on the growth of my YouTube channel. I would love to reach 100,000 subscribers, so I've got a 100,000 subscriber plaque. It was one of my goals for 2020, and you guys helped me reach it in I mean, at that time it was six months. You guys blew me away and I would not have this if it wasn't for you. And I am just now realizing that I, oh wait, maybe I can peel this. Okay. I can't peel it. Let me go get a knife. <laughs> I know Alex has a box cutter in here somewhere. There it is. Okay. Oh, I missed a spot. Oh my goodness. Okay, so the first thing, if you guys have ever watched any of these videos, then you would know that YouTube sends you a little note, which is actually on really, really nice paper. You have just done something that very few YouTube creators accomplish. You guys have probably heard so many people read this before, so I'm not going to read the whole thing to you. So wait, there's this little thing too. Oh, by actually the creators of the awards. Oh. That's cool. My award was inspected and packaged by Rick. Thank you so much, Rick, for making this happen. Oh. Oh, wait, stop. I had no idea that YouTube did this, so that's actually really cool. They have this little card in there that says, recognize your team, share the recognition by allowing your team to purchase a personalized creator award. That is so cool for people that have videographers or people behind the scenes. Obviously, I don't have anyone, but that's really cool. I had no idea that you could do that, but. Here, guys, obviously it is wrapped to protect it. Let's pull it out, a little ASMR. It's so shiny. Oh. Oh, I cannot believe this. There's so many things. I feel like a lot of people don't show you about the creator plaque. So for one, look how reflective that is. You guys can see yourself. That's so, so cool. But also the back has this I, I have no idea what this is called, but it's almost like this padded material to protect your wall or wherever you're resting it. And it also has these hook guys right here. So when you are hanging it, it already has that built in so that you don't have to ruin your award or something. That is so YouTube thinking about things. That's freaking awesome. But I... I wish my office was set up right now so I could put this up. This is 
emotional for me, holy crap. I can't believe it was October. I was sitting in my old house and it was before my YouTube channel had blown up. I think at that time I had maybe 3,000 subscribers. So October of 2019, guys, <laughs> Nancy's coming up here. I just had an inkling that YouTube was going to be the growth of my brand. And I really wanna do a full video sharing my journey, not on YouTube, not only on YouTube, but also with my blog, because my original plan was to be a blogger, guys. That's where I got started. And then I started my YouTube channel and I was about a year in my YouTube channel at that point, right? No, it had to be two years. I started in October of 2017. It was two years in my YouTube channel at that point and I was creating my vision board of what I wanted to achieve in 2020, in October, I know I'm weird, but I was doing that and I had several things that depicted YouTube and I included some of my favorite YouTubers. So Sarah's Day, Alicia Marie, but I also had camera gear. I had a Mac because that was one of the things that I wanted to purchase was a MacBook. And I also had a picture that was a pillow of, or the pillow had the logo of YouTube on it. And then I had a 100,000 subscriber plaque. And little did I know that six months later, I mean, I would go from 3,000 to 100,000 subscribers on YouTube and now have, I just, you guys are absolutely unreal and I just, I can't thank you enough for really making my dreams come true. So if that is it for this YouTube video. So if you are getting pretty close to hitting 100,000 subscribers, my advice to you if you wanna get your plaque quickly would be to email YouTube. I'm honestly not sure how long it takes for them to just on their own, realize that your channel has hit 100,000 subscribers, do their review and then put the notification within your creator studio. So for me guys, I mean, I waited three weeks just because I was curious how long it would take and obviously it takes longer than three weeks or at least it did for me. So I would email YouTube if you wanna get your plaque quickly, but that is it for this video. If if you guys liked it, make sure you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel down below, and I will see you guys back here on Tuesday and Friday with new videos. Bye guys. Give you guys a little behind the scenes of what my filming setup looks like today. We also have Fancy over here basking in the sunlight.